Ladies and gentlemen, what's up guys? Today I want to make a video on how music affects your video. What's up guys? Today I want to make a video on how music affects your video. What's up guys? Today I want to make a video on how music affects your video. Let's go! Alright, so music has a big, big punch and impact to the video, like it can turn a video really happy or really sad, whatever emotion you got going on in the video is going to be amplified tenfold based on the music you choose. But music selection is obvious, you play a sad song over a sad content and it gets more sad. You just gotta make sure that your, your song is in alignment with your mood, emotion of the, the video. Music determines emotion. The other thing that I wanted to mention when it comes to music is how I line up my music in my video and how I tend to do it and my style when it comes to music. This is this music thing is, is something that I, I pretty much uh, thought up myself. So generally what I'll do is at the start of a video, the music will gradually come into play. So it doesn't pop you in the face, just cut in, but it will gradually accelerate in. And the reason I do that is because that music at that point in time in the video is just like a little salt on top of the, the plate. You know, it's just a little extra seasoning. It's like a garnish, you know what I mean? Just like salt bay. The other thing I do a lot in my videos is if the energy level of the video goes up, I'm gonna bring the volume of the music up a little bit as well. That's gonna make the music, that's just gonna make the vibe of the, the whole show that much higher. That's something that I started doing recently, but I think it really helps out. I, what I do is I, I make the audio in my voice a little bit louder and I make the audio in the music a little bit louder. It just helps the energy get get higher. And I think the last two things I'm going to talk about is what really gives my videos some personality to it is the first thing is I'll chop off the music midway through right when I get to my point. So the music is going to be playing in the background subconsciously. You kind of get numbed out to the music and sometimes to the video. But when I chop the music off, you really focus in on what I have to say. And then I'll just jump the music right back in and everything's good and dandy and like we, we continue with our life. The second big impact player that I'll do is if I have a video that's long and it's covering several different topics, I'm gonna pick a point and where the where the topic changes, I'm gonna change the song. It's, it's kind of like, it, it, it'll help separate the video into chunks just by picking different songs. And I don't know if that one really works or not, but it's been something I've been dabbling with. I like to keep my video, my personal video, to one topic so that I don't have to deal with that. I, I prefer to cover one topic really well in six minutes than try and cover three in ten minutes and not really hit any of them really well. Does that make sense? The other thing that I wanted to chat with you real quick about when it comes to music is on my channel, I like to put music in the background of my show all the time. I just like the way kind of just adds that little layer in and it just kind of makes my show easy to watch. But I find a lot of shows don't put background music in. And it just feels like, I just feel like that puts a lot more weight on the speaker, the content creator, to carry the video than it does just the video itself. Does that make sense? I don't know, let me know what you guys think. Do you like music in the background of my videos or no? music in the background. Do you think it would be better if I just did one dry, just no music? That just sounds like... It sounds like getting a, a hamburger at a restaurant and being like, nah, you, no chipotle aioli on that, like, no sauce, like, I like this shit, like, like, you can't eat a burger without any sauce on it, but it's gonna be a lot better with the sauce. Alright, is there anything else that I wanted to talk about on the music side of things? Nope, that's it. All I wanted to talk about. 
All right, let me know what you guys think. Music yes, music no. What do you think about the way I interpret music? It's 100% my style. I didn't steal this music thing from anyone, so... Although, in hindsight, I probably did subconsciously steal it, but I never consciously studied someone's video on how they do the music so that I can do my music like them. Does that make sense? Hopefully that makes sense. Anyways, until next time, remember, peace, love, and happiness always. I'll catch you on the next one, guys. Bye. So I figured it might be fun to take you to the spot where I had my first kiss. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Happened right there. It was magical.